Hello, Aries. Aries, this is Starbright. I'm here to do a sneak peek of the month of November. Aries, for the month of November 2020. Let's see what's going on for you guys for the month of November. New love, old love, new job, hmm. a new business. See what's going on with you guys for the month of November 2020. Are you going to receive some money? Let's see what's going on. It's not going to resonate for everyone. This is going to be for the sun, the moon, rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Spirit of the earth, water, fire, and air. Show me the cards I need to see for Aries in the month of November 2020. Show me the cards I need to see for Aries in the month of November 2020. New love, old love, spirit. What do I need to know for that hard and good for the month of November 2020 for Aries? Hmm. Show me cards I need to see, spirit. Hmm. Hmm. Somebody got the king of wands here. Could be a Leo or a Cancer or somebody that's very flirty or somebody that like to have a lot of suitors. Hmm. Gonna be your energy for the month of November. Tell me more, Spirit, about this King of Wands. Could be yeah, Cancer or Leo. Hmm. This is someone is heartbroken. This person feels their repercussions of their actions. This is someone that's trying to control their emotions. Because they do see the sunshine with you. They do see the happiness with you. Hmm. They do, that person do see success with you. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. This is one that could have broke your heart. Now they feel the repercussions of their action. They're trying to control their emotion because they do, they do see the, uh, the sun with you. This is someone that's trying to be patient. This person is still holding on to you. Hmm. This person wants to send you a message that you're going to like. This is the one that betrayed you. This is the one that see you as their soulmate. Tell me more about this. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. This is someone that cut you out of their life because of a nine of pentacles. They cut you out of their life because they saw this person as someone who very, um, like, well off. They saw this person as someone who met their financial goal in life. Hmm. Tell me more about this nine of pentacles. This is who they had moved to come and waters with this person. This is who they was hiding from you. This is someone they were telling you lies about this person. Hmm. This is the one. That's why the person they ghost you. They cut you out of their life. Then they ghost you because of this nine of pentacles. This is someone they move forward with this person. Tell me more about this. Tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. This is someone they was committed to this person. Could be a Capricorn or a Taurus. Or this is someone that was very toxic. This is someone you could have a little argument or a little fight with this person. This is why this, this tower happened. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more, spirit. Mm, this is someone you had complete a cycle with this person. Or this is someone who live across the water. That's why they had your relationship on hold. Because they saw this other person with this ten of pentacles. They saw this person as a happy family, happy life, not worried about money. Yeah, it could have been a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or a Gemini. This is someone that walked away from you. This is someone that wanted to, they walked away from you because they wanted to take things to the next level with this other person. Hmm. That's why your person was juggling you and this other person. Your person trying to make a final decision. This is someone that wants to send you some kind of message or good news. This person see you as the one. They see they see you as the one who got away. They see you as a missed opportunity. Could be a Scorpio. Or somebody that you had an ending with. Or a Gemini. 
This person is feeling sad because of an ending. This is someone they wanted this victory with this other person. They do want to speak the truth to you about this other person. And, do, and they want to apologize to you. Tell me more and tell me more and tell me more and tell me more. This is someone that was very passionate about this person. So your person, your ex is making a decision on working on things. But this person was very deceitful because they started something new with someone else. That person can live at a distance. Or this is someone that was acting distant toward you. This person trying to make a decision about someone from their past. This is someone that's in and out their life. This is someone that's acting like a player. That's why your person was holding back from you. Because a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or a Libra. This is someone that's thinking about you. This person think about the good times that they had with you. This person is feeling very remorseful. And this person is feeling very regretful. This is someone that wants a steady loving relationship with you. And this person is very passionate about you. Some of you guys are dealing with someone new. That wants a steady loving relationship with you. This person is very passionate about you. This person want to take a leap of faith with you. But this person had you in some kind of competition. You and someone else. Because mm, they see this other person as this empress. Very loving. Very abundant. That saw this other person as someone be very supportive. Mm -hmm, that's why your ex is sad. Spirit. What about finances and career for Aries? Hmm. What about finances, uh, career finances, and, uh, and for career finances for Aries? <laughs> some of you guys, is this King of Pentacles. This is someone very wealthy. <laughs> some of you guys are this King of Pentacles. And you like nice things around you. Spirit says, be this, uh, be this powerful person that you are. This is something that you plant your seed with and your energy with and your time with. Spirit says, you will get your wish, but you got to be more serious in this. You got to be more creative. This is something that you've been, like I said, this is something that you've been planning. This is something that you've been wanting to grow. Spirit says, you, you will get your wish and your end of troubles will be over. <laughs> but you have to commit to this. And you will have this celebration. <laughs> Spirit said so you have to fight for this. This is something that you've been fighting for. And you've been keeping this a secret. It's stressing you out at night time. You can't get in a sleep. Mm. Spirit said so you're going to get somebody to come in and going to help you with this. Whatever you got going on. You got somebody that's coming in that's going to help you. It could be a mentor or somebody that's going to come in and help you. This is something that you've been taking a break on. You took a break from this. You were very indecisive about this. Spirit said you need to move forward. So you could be your own boss or you could be a manager. You need, you need to move forward. Yep. Could be, this might be an online business or just a, 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 a business at home or a, a, a business out, you know, in the world. Hmm. Spirit said you will have this, uh, this wheel of fortune. But you need to be more serious about this. And don't trust everybody. People are going to be watching you. Trying to gather information about you. Spirit said don't trust everybody. Spirit said I know you feel burdened right now. Because you want to be this queen of pinnacle. This is someone a hard worker. This is someone that like nice things around them. This, this is someone who very loyal and grounded. Spirit said you will be this star. This is in a career. Or a business. And you feel like people are talking about you at work. <laughs> Spirit said uh, balance things out. Because you feel like you're left all alone. You feel left out in the cold. <laughs> Spirit said you will become this happy family, happy life. You just need to commit to this. Whatever you got going on. It could be in a new business. Or your job that you want a promotion at your job, you will get this, but you have to be serious about this. 
You just have to, you have to fight for it. This is something that you've been hiding. You've been stressing over this. Some of you guys are a very loyal uh, employee. And you want to take a break from this. And you're very indecisive about this. That's why you've been holding back from uh, moving to another career or being a manager or a boss. The Spirit said you got to get more serious about this so that you can have this happy family, happy life, not worry about money. Okay? If you like my readings, give me a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, hey. If you need a personal reading for me, all the information is down below in the description box. Okay? You're going to be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Until next time, you guys. Bye-bye.